Brad Snelling, as I mentioned earlier, I'm a liaison to uh, the School of Health Sciences and, and Social Work. Um, there are actually six, six of us, though, at the library, six, six librarians. And I think it's, it's pretty likely that you'll work with a couple of the other librarians along the way, uh, particularly uh, Heidi Johnson, who, who does a lot of the class presentations for the library, and uh, Julie Rustad, who, who works a lot with the, the graduate programs and with dis distant students. Um, the handout that I brought for you and passed around um, includes a, cu a couple of resources that I think will be useful to you as, as far as orienting yourself at, at, at the library. Um, on one side of the handout, I have information on the library's homepage. And I think I'm going to try bringing that up here to see if you can have a, a quick look at it. To get to the, the library homepage, if you, if you start at the college webpage, On the top banner, if you, if you go into academics, there will be a link into the library. And that will take you to the library homepage. And the library homepage ha has links to, to some of our most important resources. Um, if you look under popular links on the left-hand side, there's a link to what we call Solar, which is kind of a, a Google-like search engine that searches against all of our databases and catalogs at the, at the library. And then we also have a link to, to Scholasticat, which is a, a catalog, a local catalog that, that searches against our, our local holdings uh, for, for the books and videos and other materials that we have cataloged at the library. Um, we also have uh, databases, journal databases, which is the, the third popular link. And uh, I'll show you more, more specifically uh, some, some databases in, uh, in social work a little bit later. We also have our, our contact information here on, on the on the home page, as well as our, our summer hours at, at the library. <clears throat> on the flip side of, of the, the, the uh, handout that I gave to you, there's information on a more specific guide that, that deals with resources and, and social work. It's what we call a lib, a lib guide. And to get to get to that from the library homepage, um, under the popular links, if you go into lib guides, is the, the fifth link down. And here you see a, a listing of all the guides. I'm just going to scroll down to the S's for, for social work. We've actually um, upgraded to a new version of, of the software that we're using for these, these subject guides. So we've been doing quite a, bit, quite a bit of work on these just during the last few days. So this is the, the lib guide then for social work. I think the reason I wanted to show this to you, I, I didn't last time, is that I've been able to uh, find some historical photographs um, of the social work program that I, I've put up here on the uh, on the homepage for, for the web guide. What year is that one? This is from 1948. Now, I, I think I think I mentioned la last time that um, the named program for social work started <coughs> in 58 or 59, but there was a department of sociology that went back way way to the uh, late 20s, like 1929. So. Uh, there, there were courses in social work from, from that time, I think, from the, the late 1920s. But if you ever want to go through the, the, the pictures here, there, there's a little arrow kind of in the upper right, and you can kind of scroll through the various pictures. Um, this is from 1949, uh, a feature social workers club. 1951 sociology club with future social workers, and so on. It's kind of fun going, going through and, and finding these uh, pictures of your, of your predecessors. So the, this, this is the, uh, the lib guide then for, for social work. And let me, let me just point out a, a couple of things here. Um, most of the, the content is under the various tabs on, on top. Um, so if I go into reference, we'll find a number of um, online encyclopedias, including the Encyclopedia of Social Work, which is kind of toward, towards the bottom, but also a number of other very useful uh, subject encyclopedias for social work that I think you'll you'll find uh, useful in your, in your coursework. Um, and just going over the, the tabs uh, to, to books, here we have a link to Scholastica, that's the catalog to, to, our, uh, to our books and then video collections. Um, and then for articles, which might be the, the most important one for, for your graduate work, um, we have a, some links to the, to the most important databases in social work, um, including Social Index with full, full text, uh, also, social work abstracts, 
and several others that I think will be uh, important to your, to your research here. So those are just a, a few highlights from the, from the LibGuide for, for uh, resources and social work. I wanted to mention to you that um, to access the databases and social work, you, you'll need to use um, the uh, login and password that you use for getting into your CSS email. And one other thing I was going to mention to you is that um, the, uh, the student IDs that you have from the college, there, there's a barcode on, on the back of those cards that could be used for uh, placing interlibrary loan requests. It, it's the, the login that you use for interlibrary loan requests. Um, and that's something that we, we can show to you in person when you're, when you're ready to place a request. It might be something that will, will be useful to you late, later on. Um, many of our resources at the library are online, uh, but I did want to invite you to, to visit the library at, at, at some point. Um, I, I think that the, the library is a physical place here at the college. So it's really quite, quite special. Uh, we're actually housed in what used to be the chapel for the, the sisters who founded the college. So uh, the chapel dates back to 1939, I believe, uh, but it was converted to, to be a library in the, in the mid-1980s. But we still have a lot of the souvenirs of, of the chapel, really beautiful old stained glass and, and, and woodwork. And uh, I particularly recommend going up to the third floor of the library, um, which I think is really one of the most beautiful rooms in, in, in Duluth, and just a great place for, for study and, and for, uh, for reading. So. We hope, hope you will drop by and then take advantage of our services and please feel free to, to contact us anytime. So, thank you. Thank you, Brad. Oh, one other comment, too. You have, are investing heavily, or at least I think we're investing heavily in ebooks. Yeah, thanks, thanks for mentioning that. I was going to show that to you real quick, too. Bluestone Reader, is that what it uses? Yeah. Um, it's one it, of them. It, what, which one did you call? Bluestone, I think Blue. it is. Yeah, that, that, you can use that uh, with iPads, I believe. Right. So your tablet, you can right. check out a book for two weeks. And, and it's, it's fairly easy to uh, to print and email individual chapters to yourself as well. But in, in the LibGuide, under this tab for books, if you look at the sub-tab for e-books, I've actually added 15 or 20 titles just in the last couple of days. <coughs> these are all publications from, from the last two, two or three years. And most of them were, were selected by, by faculty here in, in social work. So if you wanted to look at an individual title, for instance, this handbook for public health social work, you would just follow the link to the title. And on the subsequent page, there's a link to ebook full text. And that should open up the book. And usually when, when I'm using these ebooks, I'll typically just find the chapter that I'm interested in. So if I was looking at, you'll see the table of contents on the, on the left hand side here. If you wanted the chapter on lifespan, for example, that opens it up in the, in the center pane. And at that point, it's very easy to email a PDF file of, of the uh, chapter to yourself. You just go to this, uh, this email icon and then pop in your email. So that's actually just, just one way of getting at the ebooks. They're also cataloged in Scholastic Hat. Then we also have a database that's set up specifically for ebooks where you can search for, for ebooks and social work. Any other questions about, uh, about resources? I think you'll, you'll be hearing more, more from us in, in, your, in your classes and, uh, and then just drop by the library. Thanks, Brad. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Brad.